What's up, B? Operation iDroid here, and in this video, I'll be showing you how to find shiny Pokemon in Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. This week's method is the Masuda method, properly named so because the first person to confirm and reveal this shiny hunting method was none other than Game Freak's game director Junichi Masuda. For those that don't know, the Masuda method is the act of breeding Pokemon from different countries and increasing the chances of the offspring being a shiny Pokemon. Masuda method roughly increases your chances of finding a shiny Pokemon from 1 in 4000 to 1 in 1300 and is highly favorited because of the freedom to customize the Pokemon. If you're excited to learn how to do the Masuda method and finally find a shiny Pokemon, hit that like button and let's try to get 500 likes. With that being said, let's head into the tutorial. <laughs> Alright, before we begin, we need to decide our target. Keep in mind that legendary Pokemon cannot be bred, and if you're interested in getting a shiny legendary, check out my soft reset tutorial, linked in the description below. Once you select the Pokemon you would like to Masuda method, you must have its final evolution, if applicable, and another Pokemon in its breeding group of a different gender, or a ditto. There will be links in the description for all of the Pokemon breeding groups and location to capture Ditto in Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. Using Ditto is much easier in my opinion, and remember that this is a Masuda method, so one of the two Pokemon will have to be from a different country. In recent games, Game Freak has made it much easier to obtain Pokemon from different countries. In this game, you can either use the GTS or Wonder Trade to get a Pokemon from a different country and thus use the Masuda method. Now that we are prepared, we can head over to the daycare and start the breeding process. There are two daycare centers in Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. The first is found on Route 117, and the other is in the Battle Resort after completing the Delta episode. I highly recommend using the daycare center at the Battle Resort for reasons I will state later. Anyways, once you arrive at your preferred daycare center, drop off the two Pokemon and you're doing the Masuda method. However, there is still a very tedious portion to the Masuda method, which is hatching the eggs from the daycare center to see if the offspring is a shiny Pokemon. Now, I will give you the reason as to why I highly recommended the Battle Resort, because you can exploit its geographical features to effortlessly hatch eggs. The trick is simple. Upon receiving your egg from the daycare lad, go to the right until you cannot anymore, and then press up. Now you're doing circles around the island with a press of a button, but keep in mind it only works using the D-pad, not the circle pad. Finally, as I mentioned earlier, the reason the Masuda method is highly favored is because it gives you the freedom to customize the Pokemon. This means IVs, nature, ability, egg moves, and the Pokeball it'll be hatched into. However, that is a topic for another video and will be linked in the description below if you're interested in that. Anyways, doing the Masuda method doesn't mean you will automatically find a shiny Pokemon, however, it'll greatly increase your chances of hatching a shiny Pokemon. With a little patience and determination, you'll find a shiny Pokemon in no time if you continue to do the Masuda method. Thanks for watching, I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please leave a like as it supports these tutorials immensely. If you're interested in learning some more advanced tips on Masuda method and increasing your chances of finding a shiny Pokemon even more, I recommend you check out my popular Shiny Sunday series where I go out hunting for shiny Pokemon and give them away. You can click on the video to the left or for my mobile users you can follow the link in the description below to watch that video and if you would like to be notified whenever I upload a video, please hit that subscribe button to be the first to know about new shiny hunting guides and giveaways. Thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and welcome to the operation.